Hello everyone and welcome back to our graphics. In today's tutorial, we'll be creating this loading bar animation with a percentage counter. So without wasting any more time, let's just get right into it. So right here I have my after effects opened up and the first thing I want to do is bring up my pen tool to draw the bar. So instead of using a rectangle, I'll suggest you use the pen tool to draw a shape, um, a stroke instead. So make sure your fill is set to none and then your stroke is live. So I'm just going to hold shift and draw a straight line. But because of the size of the stroke, it's looking like a rectangle. So I'm just going to switch back to my selection tool and then center this on the composition like so uh, i'm going to come to the shape layer open it up and go to content go to shape and stroke so i'm going to set the bot cap change it to round cap so we can have this nice rounded rectangle like shape so i'm going to close it up like so uh so the next thing i want to do is i want to rename this to bar and then i want to um duplicate this select um press ctrl d on keyboard to duplicate and then i'm going to change the opacity of this second one below to like 30 percent so i'm going to press I'm, I'm going to press t on my keyboard to bring up the opacity and change this percentage to like 30 percent so once that is done all we just need to do is bring up the percentage counter so that's going to be our text so i'm going to select my text tool and just type in zero here then switch back to the selection tool make sure the anchor point is in the center so i'm going to hold select um, this anchor point tool hold control and then drag it's going to snap it to the center so i'm going to switch back to the selection tool and then center this on the composition like so and then bring it down bring it down so once that is done bring it further down so once that is done um, I'm going to open it up yes and then select the source text and then go to your effects and controls panel effect controls panel and then right click <clears throat> go to expression controls and then down to slider control so once you have this what we are trying to do is we want to make this slider control the text yes and also the bar so how are we going to do that very simple so we just need to make sure that you're on the first frame and then set a keyframe on this which around two seconds where you want your loading bar animation to end and then set this to 100 so what you are going to do now is you're going to select your source text yeah and then parent it to the slider so once you have that we have made the source text the slider will control the text automatically so you open this you see an expression source text so an expression source text sorry so uh, you see this simple expression right here we're just going to add to this if you look at if you go to the first frame you see that you have um, um you have decimals as the number increases we want to take that out so all we need to do is we're going to click on this and then we're going to add dot value dot to fixed while pressing you can see it's right here you can just click on enter 
once you once you do that you see that the decimals are now out and you have just all numbers so we want to add our percentage to it so we're just going to click on it and then press plus um in quotes and then you add the percentage in the quotes like so click away you see that you have zero you have your percentage attached to it like so so we need to animate our bar right now so the top bar is what we are going to animate all we just need to do is um, go to content select the bar right and then go to add and then you add trim parts once that is done you open up trim parts and then you parent the end to the slider also make sure you are selecting your text right now so that the slider control is going to show up here and then all you just need to do is parent this here so with that we have our loading bar animation with a percentage counter so i'm going to i'm going to trim this right here using end so you can so we have our loading bar animation with a percentage counter so if you enjoyed this tutorial kindly drop a like and subscribe if you're new to this channel for more design tutorials like this thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one Peace.